Hey guys. Don't say it. Poopy's over. I'm not saying anything. We went to music class today, but I couldn't really film any of it because um, there were so many kids today. And Noah was really crazy and all over the place and wanted me to hold his hand the whole time. Um, anyway, Poopy popped by and uh, had some great news. So, uh, stay tuned. Just kidding. He's signing up for school. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, we're gonna go up to school and talk to some counselor, a counselor to see all of the things that we need to do to get this guy enrolled. I'm so proud. I'm the proudest big sister ever right now. I'm so proud. He came over and said, Jen, I'm going to school, help me. Sign up. I said, let's do it. So we're gonna go do that while Noah's still asleep. And, uh, surprise mom and dad! <laughs> I don't think she's talked to you yet. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna figure this out. So keep him in your prayers, guys, because he's got a plot for college. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a punk. <laughs> I'm such a punk. Okay, let's go. This will be fun. Back to school. I'm putting on my backpack. Unfortunately, I don't think we'll do. I don't think he'll be able to do fall semester. Yeah, but we'll go sure. figure everything out and talk and get the ball rolling. Dinner in the park because it's really fun and it's nice out and no one needs to go run around. Dinner at the park. Oh yeah, sorry. Dinner sunny, at the park. The sunny days are limited. Yes, they are. They're coming to a close. So we're gonna take advantage of them and go eat some Indian food in the park. Huh? Hi. Hi. And Poopy's with us still too. Hey. He's had a good successful Poopy. sign up for school day. It's been great. It's been great. Yo, do you know how many times that people ask me where that name come from? And do you know how many times I have to answer IDK? IDK. I legitimately do not know how that started. I don't either. You just became Poopy. I call him Buzz. <laughs> Actually, growing up, his nickname was Buzz. My dad and my brothers, like everyone called him Buzz. I don't even know where that came from. Where did yeah, dad start you, Buzz? Because like, you started with Monkey Boy. Oh, and he then, was Monkey Boy. And then it turned into Poopy, and I like, I don't like, how does- No, mom how, called you Monkey Boy. How does Monkey Boy- I have like, always called you Dave. I uh, yeah, you called, called me Dave. Dave and Poopy ever, like, ever since I can remember. Yeah. I don't know why. It's just what I call them, guys. It's a call name of endearment. Dangerous Dave. Dangerous Dave. Suave Dave. Gosh. Daddy Dave. Oh, gosh. <laughs> yeah, that's a little weird. Slide into second, slide into second, slide into second, slide into second. There you go. Racers, take your mark. Get set. Get set. Go. Go. And now, time is passing, leaves are falling, falling to the ground, and I want to go. Roll down. Outside the house where I grew up, I got the sky was so blue. Shake off the dirt that stained the bottom of my shirt and pick a dandelion. Find all the magic in the things that we believed and know that I am fine. Recite the stories of old Building blocks that scrape the sky And stand so tall as proof As reality unfolds Piece by piece The puzzle shows us meaning in the truth When our faith is lost Between the lines We find the words we want to melt the bite of the fries. Tick tock, lose a little clock. <laughs> <laughs> Today was a really good day. 
I think, I mean, it was kind of weird because it was like cloudy and rained a little bit. Just, it was a good day, good relaxing day. I think we all needed this day. I'm proud of David signing up for school. <laughs> We've been trying to get that kid to sign up for school for so long and we're just so excited. So hopefully everything goes smoothly and that he, uh, that we, that, he, that we do it. That does it. Everyone go send him love. Like, yeah, you can do it. Sign up for college. Yeah. Go David. <laughs> for some more encouragement. Um, cause it's scary. It's scary signing up for a commitment like college. College is a big commitment and uh, it can be scary. So we're really excited for him. And uh, we're just so proud of Noah. I just love that kid so much. He's been really good. You know, he still has some uh, incidences during the day where he lets his hands fly. But uh, he, he's been really good. We've realized that I'm still reading my book. I've gotten distracted and busy the past couple days with family and stuff. So I haven't finished it. But um, I think me and Sam have tr been trying to like learn about him more um, and he just he just needs to be doing something his mind needs to be doing something or else the tantrums happen really he he throws a tantrum or he throws a fit when he's bored most of the time or he wants to fight you when he's bored so we just gotta keep that kid busy and he's a happy camper really um, sometimes if he does a little too much then he can throw a fit you know so we gotta find the happy medium of like doing stuff it's good he's growing up and learning so much you guys he likes books now <sighs> it makes me so happy for a while i was like oh my kid doesn't like books he read like four books upstairs he just likes to flip through the pages you all have to have a book though he likes dad, dad to have a book and mama to have a book and then noah likes to read the book and he likes to show us what's on the page we're just really proud of him it's been a really fun since he's turned two it's it's been pretty fun like tan minus the tantrums because those have been kind of crazy. But him learning so much. It's like crazy how much they learn when they reach that milestone of two years old. It's insane. He's so smart. Proud of him for his, for all his new words. He said like five new, five or six new words just today. So it's been really fun. A little PJ. She's just the sweet little thing. She doesn't stop moving though either. Gosh, she won't just sit in your lap. She has to be sitting or standing or wiggling or something. <laughs> The only time she stops moving is, moving is when she's asleep. <laughs> that was a good day. I hope you guys had a good day as well. Just want to say that today was a good day. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Just a little taste. Just a little taste. Oh, her face. Ooh. How do you feel about that? Your, your sister, your brother loved the squash. Mm. Are you going to be more picky than your brother? I don't think she's going to like food as much as her brother did. How do you feel about it? No? Not interested? Come here, you got to show Sissy how to eat that, okay? Can you show her how to eat it? You like this as a baby. You used to eat this. Will you take a bite? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Okay, all done. We don't have to eat anymore. Just a little sample today. Just a little sample. You loved baby food too. Oh yeah. It's baby yummy. Yeah, you want to try it? <laughs> Why not? Noah calls food yummy. So this is baby's food. Baby's baby yummy. Baby yummy. Hi. Hi. She was laughing so much a minute ago. Hi! 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 I'm going to put it on her lap. Open your legs. <laughs> Hi! Hi! Oh, careful. Oh, oh, oh. It's okay. She just wants to sit up. Hi! 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 How many times can mom say hi? 
in one video. Whoa, loosey goosey legs, loosey goosey. <laughs> okay, Noah's having a little bit of a rough morning. So I explained earlier that I wanted to try the uh, flower sensory table. So we're gonna try it. I think I'm gonna take it outside though. So he doesn't get flour all over my kitchen. I'm just gonna put some flour in these little containers and have him, like, he can spoon it into the little cupcake holders and find little things in here. Sam ran to the store to get lunch stuff, so Noah's a little upset about that. Huh? Yeah, I'm gonna put flour in here and you're gonna have to dig for your toys, okay? Is that gonna be fun? You can play with flour. Flour? Flour, yeah. Okay, let's see how this goes. Okay, so I don't know if I really did this correctly. I just put toys in the in the cookie sheet and then put flour all over them. So I told him he can dig. You can dig? Dig for your toys in there. Yeah, have fun, okay? You can do whatever you want with that flour. You just can't eat it, okay? That wouldn't taste very good. Good job, wow, that's very precise. Very precise placement of that flour. I started following this um, Instagram account called Toddler Activities. Toddler something, Toddler Sensory, I don't know. Anyway, I just started following her. I saw her through another friend's page and she has a whole bunch of different activities for toddlers. So I was like, oh, this will be great, especially for this winter when it's cold and we're stuck inside to do cool little activities like this. I'll definitely have to do this one again. I think he'll really enjoy this one. I also, there's also one like this that you can do with beans like dry beans that I think Noah would like as well. I might try that one next, but yeah, look. There's just a bunch of little toys in there that I didn't really care if he got flour all over them or whatever, but are you having fun? Do you like digging in the flour? You can touch it, you can play with it. Does it feel cool? Can you see something? What is it? What'd you find? What'd you find? Show me. Penguin! Cool! Blue. What else do you have in there? Oh, C-3PO! <laughs> oh, a zebra! Cool! This should keep him busy for a little while, at least. <laughs> I'm also learning that, uh, not to get, rise. I mean, and also I've learned this from my sister-in-laws. They always have told me, like, when your kid gets to, like, a level 10, you know, or gets to that level of anger and frustration, don't match the energy level. Just try to stay neutral because they, he, he can tell, especially when one of us like our, our energy's high and like we're upset or we're like frustrated. He can, and he feeds off of it. So I'm definitely learning to not, to try to just stay, they say try to stay neutral even though you want to scream and <laughs> yell. <laughs> so I've really been trying to work on that as well. Especially when like trying to help him understand like, hey, this is, you don't do this. To stay at like a neutral level. So he like really can understand instead of me like, no, why are you doing this? Because then he's like, ah, and I'm like, ah, and we're both, ah. <laughs> um, but yeah. Also, a little update on my tomatoes. I decided to try, some of you guys are suggesting that we just pick some of the stuff and let it like continue growing and ripening on our counter. Um, and so that's what I did. And here's one. This was not red when I picked it. This one's almost done changing color. And this big one, I wasn't sure if the big ones would change color, but this one's actually starting to ripen now too, which is cool. I kind of just leave them up there in the sun. Sam, we picked one of Sam's jalapenos. It kind of needs to go in the trash now. It kind of got a little old, but he's got a few more growing. That's really kind of fun to watch. Can you bury them inside of there now? Can you hide the toys back in that big one? Whoa. We're playing with flour. What the? <laughs> I buried toys in flour. I saw Dang. people doing this on Instagram. Dang, you love that. I might have put a little too much flour in there, 
but he's Doesn't having a lot of fun. He loves digging in the dirt. Right. So he I just, would dig in the dirt all day if you let him. Right. So uh, I decided to this have him cleaner dirt. dig for toys yeah. in the flower. Sweet. Noah, should we hide him again? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I should have expected that, but I was not prepared for there to be flower dancing as well. Um, so if you don't keep an eagle eye watch on your kid at all times, this will probably happen. So maybe monitor your child while they play with flower and dance with it. <laughs> he looks like Casper the Friendly Ghost. He is covered in flower. Oh my gosh. No, you're supposed to keep it in the tins. You're supposed to keep the flower in the tins. Oh boy. Well, at least he's having a good time. <laughs> Did you have fun in the flower? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if we're gonna do this one for a while. I think next time we're gonna do beans. Football. What's it called? Football. Football. Can you say foot? Foot. <laughs> no, he foot. has a hard time with F, the F sound. Foot. Football. Football. Good try, Thank yeah. That is football, and look how beautiful that new part of the stadium is. <gasps> it makes the school look so much it's nicer. Nice There's it a high school so nice. game. I think it might be. Is it tonight? Okay, we saw that there is um, some football going on at the stadium, and Sam had had heard that high school was playing. Oh, we missed it. We went down the wrong lane. Um, anyway, so we are just gonna come up. I think. It, we're just gonna come up for a few hours before bedtime and uh, see the high schoolers play football in the new stadium. So that's kind of exciting for them. Me. Yeah, and Noah's really excited to watch football. Oh, big piles of rocks. Definitely don't want to park our new car by big piles of rocks. They're still working, like doing finishing touches on the stadium right now. But uh, it'll be fun. I think Noah will really enjoy this. <laughs> Is that Owies? Yeah. Owies? How do you throw, how do you, how do you throw, throw a football? Like that? How do you, what do you say, what do you do when you score a touchdown? Good. Oh, there we go. Oh, barely in there. Oh, it in. Hello, Noah. <laughs> Whoa. I know, finally. Let me see no, my niece. I've like, never seen. What's up, guys? What's up? I know it's cameras are wrong. Hi, no, Papa Noah. And, and little man's awake. Oh, he just he, well, he's he's eating right now. Hi, hey, baby girl. I want my baby mm. Raker. Oh, don't but go. But you really look like your mom. Yeah, she. I feel like he's looking more like Matt though. Like oh, when he was born, he was pure Haley.